Okay, that was really, really, really fucking weird. some fucking weird shit. Why? All right, are you, uh, you still here? Okay, so I think I know what happened. I have, uh, I have a script for uploading YouTube videos in a certain folder and it decided that now was a good time to start the upload. So that's what happened, was no matter what connection I was on, it was just trying to max out the upload, so you were pretty close to right about the, the downloading thing. Except for I'm uploading. So, pretty good guess. So do you have to hit reload or anything for it to come back up, or do you just sit on the same page and then eventually it just comes back? This is a good idea, leaving my uh, computer retards alone. Or they'll get killed by some random enemy. Oh, they're going to follow me. Good. <clears throat> okay, good. I was, <laughs> I was worried if you had to hit refresh that everyone else would just bail. I mean, it looks like we're still... Aw, oh, we lost one or two. Shit. You know what, the one, at least one of them that we lost was, it was just my preview. Oh fuck, there's the grenade. I seen it that time. Get out here, bitches. They stand there, they don't give a shit. Fuck, really? Shoot 
Got 30 bullets left, I'm good. Oh, come on, we're not playing this fucking game. Die already. Now I gotta go back upstairs and get the truck. How should I know? Okay, okay. Well, we can't hang around here waiting for more of them to show up. Let's get the truck and get the hell out of here. Tom, you drive. I'll follow behind one of the other cars. <clears throat> Where the fuck am I? Why am I so lost right now? Those guys didn't stand a chance. God, fucking YouTube trying to upload. Go truck, go! Oh no, it crashed like that other dude's. I seen another video that crashed in that same exact spot. Fuck me. Skip through this. Great. I'm going to get lots of practice through this level. <clears throat> I could probably rush through this pretty quick, though. Those guys aren't even looking the right way. Wow, nice fucking blood splatter. Go my fucking way. Holy shit, he just took one hell of a blast. Get the fuck out of my way! God, at least aim at the fucking other guys. not repeatedly crash on me. Alright, so go down the stairs, go back up the stairs. Is he gonna stand on a fucking grenade? You stupid fuck! Oh. 
computers and games shouldn't be able to they shouldn't be able to do that Doesn't give a fuck. I'll follow behind one of the other cars. See, in the in the other guy's stream that I seen, I only seen this part of the game. But um, as he kept no, are you fucking kidding me again? As he kept trying to leave the parking garage, it kept crashing on him. And it took him like three or four times to get out of the parking garage. Fuck. Uh, any recommendations on this? Maybe I should just move the car and then get back out of it right away. Fight the recoil. This is what happens when I get annoyed with games. I just go full auto. What the hell? There's two guys that were supposed to were supposed to show up over here. One came from this car, one came from the down the ramp. That's different. Fucking grenade, you dumbass. What the fuck are you doing? Yeah, that was pretty bad. What are you doing? Oh shit. You dumb. Okay. 
Wow, I got... I got pretty fucking wrecked on that one. Alright, let's get the fucking truck and get out of here. What the fuck are you doing up here? Man, the game is really trying to mess with me. There's one of the two that were missing. <laughs> the game is just messing with me. Alright, who's getting in with me? You getting in the fucking truck? Are you? Alright, no one's getting in the truck. Please don't fucking crash. Please don't crash. Push, push, push. What the f- It's- <sighs> It's like the headlights come on and then the game is just done. Okay, I need to look in the menu. Maybe the headlights on before- I leave the garage. I don't know. And maybe that'll prevent it from when it... I don't know. What if I crash the truck lightly to turn off your headlights? Isn't there a button? I mean, it, it definitely looks like it has something to do with those lights coming on, doesn't it? I mean, I could just smash it into a wall quick before I... I could even shoot out the headlights, can't I? I'm going to try shooting them out, too. Dude, what is... That dude that ran out there, he just wanted to die, I think. These guys are using pump shotguns from like a mile away. What do they think's gonna. Holy fucking shit! Did I hit a gas cap? that health. Okay, so I think with this update, this graphics mod, it says that if the game crashes that you're supposed to rename some folders by putting like an underscore after the name of the folder and then once you get past the, the point where it crashes you're supposed to rename them back. But I'm not too sure. So if it if it crashes again after I do the headlight thing, I might have to read up on that. Alright, this guy finally came out. I wonder if he spawned in on the, the top floor last time. to sit on top of a fucking grenade. God. If I shoot the guy with the grenade first, I wonder if he would just drop it and they would all explode. Holy shit, I mean shredded. Dude, that guy 
fucked me up. Are they all dead? Okay, why am I still hearing the music? Who's this fucker? What the fuck is he doing? Get in for Christ's sake. Okay. What the hell was that calling? Who were those hoods? <coughs> How should I know? Okay, okay. Well, we can't hang around here Okay, I am going to shoot out those headlights. Yeah, I don't think it's letting me. Controls, car, change camera, horn, brake. There is no fucking light button, is there? Shit. Alright, I'm gonna... I'm gonna try to hit a wall. Maybe it's because Polly wasn't in the... He wasn't in the truck with me last time? Okay, so I think the headlights are out, right? I'm gonna I'm gonna slowly bump I'm gonna slowly bump through the other cars too, not just ram them. See what happens. Roll really, really slowly. Oh my god, it worked. I wonder if it had something to do with the headlights. No, not easy peasy when you have to play it fucking four times. Oh. Oh. I really didn't want to have to give up on the game. What the hell's going on now? Somebody's shooting at me. I think they popped my tires. That is not cool. Oh, fuck. They did pop my tires. The truck is like barely... Barely turning. Great. Now I gotta deal with people chasing me down with a truck that barely drives. But at least I can reload from where I was. Maybe Sam will... Pit maneuver me instead of them. Awesome. Thanks, Sam. Or whoever the hell you are. Cool. I don't wanna die! I don't wanna fucking die either. How about you do something about it? Oh dude, that other guy with us has one health. How is he? He's gonna get into an accident on the way back. He's gonna be the one that screws us over. Guarantee it. That's m oh, that's me. Okay, <laughs> I didn't even. It didn't click. I'm dead. I am very dead. It's gonna be any random car is gonna pull out in front of me, and that's the end. Dude, don't shoot at the fucking cops. Or whoever the hell you're shooting at. Would have been nice if it would have just completed the second circle. Second spin. What? How many times did you die? Yeah, I would have to assume it was practically uh, every level multiples of times. I mean, you can barely even crash, you can barely even bump into another car without losing like four health. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, I would, I would definitely lose my patience with that. I don't mind playing games on like hardcore or 
their hardest levels or anything, but one health, any fucking bullet, and you're done. Five total hours? How the hell did you do that? What happened to those gangsters that were chasing me? They just, they just disappeared. They just gave up. Are you just skipping like every cutscene in the game then? Seems like a lot of these cutscenes so take like quite a while. On the way of things again, boss. We can't seem to shake off this bad luck. Boys, you won't believe this, but it's completely the other way around. The only one who really had bad luck this time was Morello. What? I found what? out who our Mr. Gates really was. And a software Gates was never really from Kentucky. He was a small-time thief who stole the goods from Morello and wanted to sell them to us. Morello doesn't think that he almost stopped our deal, but that we pinched a truckload of his most expensive whiskey. I bet that bastard's happy now. Unbelievable. Well, that worked out just fine. <coughs> Let's drink to that. To another success, boys. He knew the Salute. whole time that we were fucking over someone else. Pretending like, oh, we didn't know. The end of Prohibition. That, well, that the end of Prohibition over. in 33. You probably weren't too happy, huh? Nah, the end of the good old days. Yeah, not too happy, but it wasn't all bad. Eventually, I did get <clears> married <throat> to Sarah and had a daughter. It was a good time. Wow, they just skipped way but ahead on that. Life went on in business. We made a huge amount of dough during Prohibition, which we invested into new deals. A lot of them were legitimate. We had regular firms like construction, transport, restaurants. We ran labor unions. And of course, there was gambling, betting, the lotteries. We actually did really well. We just tried to stay out of drugs, even if it wasn't always easy. Come on, business is business, right? You're way off there. The Cousin Nostra ain't no patties a Chinaman. With drugs comes big money and even bigger oh, problems. Racist. When someone has a problem with the cops because of drugs, he does the sensible thing. He admits it. If his family catches him, they rub him out. Drugs are taboo. So what? There's some kind of grand pool. At least until Mafia 2. Something like that. The leading families choose a boss of bosses. They sort out the big problems and set the rules of the game. So, criminals who break the law have their own <coughs> courts that judge them? That's just great. Laws aren't changeless holy words. <coughs> Every country in the world has their own. It's just somebody with a lot of power <coughs> applying their own will. It depends on the person whether they'll serve someone else blindly or apply their own will. Why should the Don be restrained? The Mafia prevailed through prohibition with its own laws. A handful of poor, uneducated immigrants from Sicily were stronger than all the laws, courts, and police here in the States. That took some doing. What? With murder? With the <coughs> suffering they caused? Come on. You think that the Mafia just murders innocent people? The Mafia punishes those who break laws. And the majority of your laws, too. Unfortunately, we can't put anyone in jail or find them. Everybody who comes and works for us knows what to expect if he breaks the rules. People lie and steal, and there are lots of criminals here who get unbelievable pleasure when they steal from the mob, as well as the mafiosos who get pleasure from cheating the state. <clears throat> and what about all the payoffs, robberies, and raids, huh? Hey, the cops ain't no saints, neither. No Don encourages his men to go around harming people. And what other people do on their own isn't our concern. And as for payoffs, most people come to the Don for help and advice on their own. And they'll pay gladly for it. The Don is an esteemed person. But not every Don is like Salieri. That's the truth. So do you have a speed run of this go. video so or this game somewhere? Your system works, but you know why? Because you're a bunch of selfish murderers. <clears throat> And you only care about your own game. 
All your efforts are spent ensuring that you live like pigs in shit. That's why you're so successful. You're only looking out for yourselves. We look out after everybody. A few cops have to ensure law and order for all, and that's a much harder job. That's true. But you can easily leave the Don outside your protection. <clears throat> He'll watch his own back. And what about you? What are you sitting here for? Bon appetit. Ah, Tommy. I'm glad you're here. I was afraid <coughs> I'd miss you. Hey, boss. What's going on? There's something I've been looking forward to all week. I'm going to Pepe's restaurant for lunch, but my personal bodyguard has called <coughs> in sick. There's nobody here who could take me, and I prefer not to go to these things alone. You'll take me, won't you? Certainly, boss. Bravo. Let's get going, then. I'm already pretty hungry. <coughs> Have you got a piece on you, Tommy? Yeah, I got one. You think I'll need it? Well, <laughs> probably not. But it's better to be sure. You know how it is. We'll take my car. <coughs> He's got the race car. Not really a race car, but it's pretty sweet. I'm really looking forward to this. Pepe is a native Sicilian and above all a fantastic chef. Whenever I feel like a specialty from back home, I go to him. Wait till you try his cheeses. Forget about it. Luigi's a great cook, but Pepe is a real Forget master, a it. maestro. I'm gonna notice the music changing every time I switch like areas of the game. <sighs> you shouldn't have told me. This looks like that alleyway from Mafia 2 where we had the uh, MG42s. How was that level called? The Butcher? No. Buzzsaw. I don't know why I remember that. I love that level though. <coughs> I could eat a horse. The pizza sounds so good hey, right now. Don't tell you every welcome. Happy. You don't even know how much I'm looking forward to your <coughs> specialties. Fantastic meal, Peppy. I haven't eaten that well in a long time. Molto grazie, Don. Praise it from a gourmet like you always makes me feel it with joy. Oh, please, I'm no gourmet. 
If you knew what I ate for dinner yesterday, you definitely wouldn't say that. <laughs> Can I get you anything else, Adana? I have an excellent Chianti. Really? Let's get it out here then, Peppy. At once, sir. How'd you like it, Tommy? It was fantastic, boss. I'll have to bring Sarah here sometime. Ah, yes. You certainly should, Tommy. Just be careful that Sarah doesn't take offense. She cooks worse than Peppy. <laughs> What's uh? <coughs> what the hell is going on? Hey, this is ruining my you. lunch. Marilla must have nothing better to do. So they could have at least let me own. taste the wine, Gavones. Let's get this over with. <laughs> Throw him his present, Joe. Maybe we'll smoke him out. That is one delayed fucking grenade. You know, they could have just walked in there and pulled out a pistol boss. and shot both What'd of us, say? and it would have been over My right there. Yes, boss. Yes, boss. It looks boss. like we won't get out this way. Try and run around the back of them while I keep them entertained. Oh, I yes, could boss. get out the front. Sort of pissed away all my ammo. All right, I'll go out the back. <coughs> oh. Is this dog gonna fuck me up or what? Kind of afraid to be around him. <coughs> Over. Alright, two to the head. Mafia style. One, two, three. Come on, man. Three shots. That's just unfucking fair. And where the fuck did you just come from? I am. Fuck. There's only one dude. Now another one's gonna pop out and shoot me. There he is. <coughs> yeah, I didn't. I didn't kill the dog this time. when do you come in here? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I fucking knew that was coming. Since when are they coming from the alleyway? game keeps changing it up in ways that I don't expect. I got one fucking bullet left. What am I doing?
Oh, it's random. Okay. Oh, it's just weird. Because, I mean, usually I wouldn't expect that in, like... I would just expect them to do the same thing, like, every time, no matter what. Dude. Usually I'm much more, uh, cautious when I play shit. <clears throat> For some reason I keep getting too rammy with... I don't want that. Give me back my... Whatever. Dude, this, this is like the same setup. Why did I do that? This is literally like the same setup as that buzzsaw level. I gonna find a Playboy magazine up here somewhere? Nope, just domestic abuse. Did you find the uh, the Playboy ish? The Playboy magazine's kind of like an odd choice to throw in a mafia game. supposed to go back back inside now that was weird I didn't expect to find three of them sitting in the alley do all this shit and then die to some fucking alley campers yeah it did there was a lot of very odd scenes that I wasn't expecting. I have to say, you got balls, Tommy. You that uh, that ass. nightclub. You weren't so bad. The yourself, dude getting a blowjob. Christ, that making was all crazy. those odd sounds, and then Thank all of a sudden God she Pepe bends hit. up. Poor guy. I'll have to send him some dough for repairs. We should. <clears throat> Boss, I'd like to know how they knew where we were. GPS. You think they followed us? I don't think so, Tommy. I have a feeling I know who set me up. Sam rat you out? Who? Carlo, Carlo. My bodyguard. That goddamn son of a bitch. He's the only one who knew where I was going. And he also excused himself from work today. He knew very well what was going to happen. That sounds pretty likely. <clears throat> yeah, I think so. I'll tear him apart like a rag doll. Carlo lives in a rented house in Little Italy, a little way <clears throat> from our bar. There's a pizzeria downstairs. We're going. All right, let's get in our car. Fucking V16. I if I should just take the north bridge. This guy's on the third island, right? The one I'm looking for right now. 
or the, the furthest left island. Not this bullshit again. Oh, really? You're gonna fucking arrest me now? I'm gonna get back in the fucking car. Let's go, man. <clears throat> oh, no. Well, I'm not dealing with that today. Find a Playboy right here. Carlo, you bastard. We're coming for you. Let's do it, Tom. Break down the door, bust in there, and kill the bastard. Jesus Christ, we don't even know it was him. Ah! He's run down the I mean, now we do, because he's running, but... Oh, I gotta go down. Why am I going up? <clears throat> Holy shit. Shut up, lady, or you're next. <laughs> Bastard, Tom. Didn't I already do it? Don't be an idiot. Shoot the bastard. Who's the naked dude I killed then? What the fuck? There's. All right, go already. Jesus fucking Christ. Oh, we're gonna go backwards now. Carlo, yo bastard. We're coming for you. Let's do it, Tom. Break down the door. Bust in there and kill the bastard. <laughs> Yeah, he just jumps right to murder. That's He's crazy. Shut up, lady, or you're next. <laughs> so, Police. kill that bastard, Tom. Don't be an idiot! Shoot the bastard! I did! Jesus Christ! Oh, 
Don't waste your time with him. He's shit. Yeah, I get that. Don't waste your time with him. He's shit. Oh my god. <laughs> you know what, boss? <coughs> what? That's the first time I knocked someone off in their underpants. It's nothing. First time for me, too. There's a first time for everything. Oh my god. This game is just filled with fucking weird quotes. Well, who do we have here? How are you, Sergio? Staying out of trouble? I see you got a new punching bag. Well, the gentleman here thinks that the financing of our labor union ain't fair, and he wants to strike. I've always said a strike is a bad thing. Real bad. Unless, of course, it's organized by my dear brother for a higher goal. You won't get away with this. The boys will show you. I think you're overestimating their bravery. You cockroach. I didn't come for this discussion, unfortunately. We'd like to introduce you to some of our principles about labor unions in this free country of ours. Carry on, boys. <clears throat> What's the reason for your coming, brother? Salieri is alive. What? How could he survive? Oh. I'm afraid in the current situation Bastard. we can't ask him. Burn it hell. And there is nobody else who could tell us oh. what happened. Our guys are dead, and the customers at the restaurant are dead. And that sneak Carlo is as well. Could you please shut up? We're trying to talk here! Go to That's hell! There's no way to talk to Mr. Morello! Bum! God, he should have been there alone. How could that old man kill so many of our guys? He's as old as me, so I wouldn't say that. But he probably wasn't there alone. I think he'll be planning how to get rid of us right now. <clears throat> what should we do? I will try to figure out something. Anyway, be careful. <clears throat> now his best guys will be after us. So, we're really at war? We have been for a long time already. But now, more than ever before, take good care of yourself, brother. Boss, it looks like he's had enough. What do you want us to do with him? I don't know. Finish him off and dump him in the ocean. All right, I got a V-16. That's all shot up. Tommy, that assassination attempt means that Morello has openly declared <coughs> war on us. We have to deal with him. If Morello didn't have accomplices with the politicians and other important city organizations, our forces would be nearly equal. If we liquidate those people, our opponent will be a lot weaker. That's exactly what we gotta do. Eliminate his strong <coughs> contacts. Right. And as we all know, an all-out war must be avoided. Get the generals. Then the soldiers will give up without a fight. So this is what we'll do. We'll finish them off one by one. What do you mean exactly? The first in line is the city councilor who's caused us so much trouble. Yep. It's that mission finally. Morello got him into politics, and that makes him a big supporter. Running for office, or I don't we'll remember what it's called. take care of him after the boy. And I mean today. The councilor is celebrating his birthday and has decided to throw a huge shindig. He's having it on a steamboat with fireworks and the whole nine, and he'll be making a speech to the paparazzi. There'll be a lot of people there who won't do dick against us when they see what happens to him. It sounds pretty risky. But well worth the risk. Vincenzo knows the plan. Okay. As I said, it's on a steamboat. It won't be easy to get in without an invite, but I know you can do it, Tom. Above all, try not to raise suspicions before we reach our goal. Of course, you won't get a weapon past the security, but I've dealt with that already. As soon as you get on deck, go to one of the men's rooms. He's gonna give me a small a brass knuckle. There. Afterwards, just wait outside a while. The counselor will probably be hiding in his cabin, but he'll be out for the start of the celebration in his speech. <clears throat> That's your big shot. During the speech, you're gonna pop him down. Pop him. It's em. got to be in public, and this speech is the best opportunity. There'll be a big crowd there, so you can blend in with it once this thing is all done. Why is my foot and floating off the floor? I'd like to get floor. back to shore in one piece. Afterwards, it'll be Jump nuts. Jump overboard. There'll be some security guards on a boat, and you should be able to get past them in the chaos. If not, get to the bow, and Paulie will pull up in a boat and bring you back safely. So what, Tommy? It my won't float. be a picnic, but you should All of our feet off. are, like, floating off the floor. Okay. I'll do it. The boat is anchored on the waterfront on Central Island. You better get going or you'll miss it. Keep an eye on the time. 
Boner Fortuna, Tom. Boner for the what? The fuck? Who says that? <clears throat> Who the fuck is this? Oh, okay. Here we go again, Ralphie. Exactly. Today I need something for one use because we don't know how it's going to work out. Hey, 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 hey Tommy, D -d 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 that's no big problem. I have here this little number. They're, they're pretty, p p pretty p popular these days. Also, they're p p p pretty solid. L -l look how easy they are to nab. I've never seen this lock before. I don't yeah, think I can get in. That should do the trick. Pontiac 8. I trap myself. Uh, maybe I can squeeze around it. Oh, come the fuck on. Thank you, game. Oh, wow. Look at that. I could steal their car. I have uh, never tried this before. <laughs> oh, look. I can see inside the bar from over here. I don't want to go over the edge. <clears throat> Give me your car. Yep. I wonder what happens if I just fall off the edge. Or if I try to go into the bar. <laughs> so I guess that's one way to piss off the game. Oh, it just fades to fades to black. Tom. Come on, man. Let me... Well, here we go again, Ralphie. Today I need something for one use, because we don't know how it's going to work out. <laughs> Come on, hey, push me into the wall. Th 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 that's no big problem. I have here this little number. They're, they're pretty, p p pretty p popular these days. Also, they're p p p pretty solid. That would have been awesome if it would have let me hijack that other car, though. Then bring it back into this area, and then it... Claim it as my yeah, own. Great, that Get in the trick. front. <clears throat> Loading. Trying to, but I failed. Left. <clears throat> oh, fuck, I forgot to get on that bridge.
So when you uh, when you speed run this game, are you playing it with mouse and keyboard, or just like a controller? Oh, there's a ship way out there. supposed to drive to a different spot or is this is this it I just walk around back <coughs> well time to go get on the Titanic I have to go over there. <clears throat> hey, mister, you got an invite? If not, can I take a walk? Um, I must have left it someplace. Um, yeah, so like I said, beat it. Okay, I have to go steal an invite from somebody. Infiltrate the paddle steamer. Am I supposed to just talk to somebody in this crowd? <clears throat> Hitman this shit. Hmm. That's gonna yell at me to get to work. <clears throat> oh, I didn't check to see if I had a okay, gun on me. Enjoy yourself. Probably should have checked and tried to drop it. Some of these dames ain't getting it. Maybe they want to try a real one. A bucket. What the fuck am I going to use that for? <clears throat> Has anybody seen my husband? Did you see that? <laughs> You're not even married. Just her way of turning you down. 
Can I just throw the bucket into the paddles? Oh, shit. This is the counselor's private room. Mind your own business. Fine. I don't see any hookers in there. The poor boy, such a good person, with such bad luck. It must be terrible to lose a son. His son was the terrible thing. The what? I've never seen such a beast. I'm not surprised someone turned on him. That's terrible. There are supposed to be fireworks, don't you know when? I don't have time. At least I can We're dine decently lucky with the weather today, huh? Yes, indeed. I'd like another There's coffee. There's so many lovely people mm, Me here. too. They're all so the nice. Comes from Alaska. Okay, what the fuck am I missing here? Typical. This has to happen to me. Skipper has key. Okay, so I need to find the skipper. <clears throat> I don't think I've been in there yet. There's so many lovely people here. I don't know who They're the fuck you so are. Nice. You wish anything else? The counselor talks about order. But he really lives it up himself. Unfortunately, we can't serve the crew. It was a wonderful idea. I'll talk to you on the captain a what a wonderful boat he had. Fuck, man. Assuming I have to go down to the bottom level. There's so many lovely people here. They're all so nice. Hey there. Do you know where the keys are to that broken John? Don't bug me. I have a lot of work to do. Is this him? That's right. Run this way. This is a good spot for you. Fuck. Fuck, fuck, fuck. No. No, there's witnesses. Seriously, why aren't you going down? Jesus Christ. Why is why is nobody like panicking? Yeah, yeah, I know. How else was I supposed to get it? Okay, I gotta go in the other one, but... Oh, dude. Really? Oh, shit, somebody's freaking out. What's going on here? What's he doing in there? Taking a big old shit? Or did something like... Something go wrong in the game? Soft locked? I don't know, maybe. <coughs> How else was I supposed to get that key? And was he supposed to come back out of this bathroom, like, right away, or what?
I did Hello ask him, and he said to don't bother me with this right yourself. now. Good evening. Yes, it's lovely here. How are you? I hope you like it. Thanks. We're glad to hey, be here. I'm glad you could make it. It's wonderful. Thank you. Oh, if you ask him again? Okay. <clears throat> Sorry, I didn't read the last. I think it's time. All right, I think it's time. You can come out any time. Apparently he likes it in there. Come on, man. Get your ass out of here. All right, we'll just fucking try this again. <clears throat> I probably fucked something up by not asking this guy twice. Some of these dames ain't getting it. Maybe they want to try a real man. So nice Alright, I have to go up to the bathroom first and then come back down. Typical. This has to happen to me. Really sure why I went this way. <clears throat> Where the fuck did he go? Hey there. Do you know where the keys are to that broken John? Don't bug me. I have a lot of work to do. Hey, I kind of need those keys. I left something there. Yeah, right. Maybe I'll lend them to you. But you got to promise to clean up that mess in there and bring them right back to me. <clears throat> I'll wait in the stern for you. Clean up? Um, sure. You bet. Okay, there you go. But bring them back. It didn't say I got a key, did it? Did you see that, huh? I didn't see it, but I'm assuming I have them. Oh, you may be God. What a stink. Holy shit, I didn't, uh... It didn't pull me in that time. Oh, I need that bucket, don't I? And then he cleans it. Possibly. Do I have to actually clean the bathroom? Here, take your keys back. So, you see how easy that was? You ain't so bad. You could open a cleaning firm. Yeah. <clears throat> and I'll use you as the rag. The fuck? You trying to piss him off? All right. Did you enjoy the dinner? Sure, I'll do it for you. Do I have to clean the bathroom to set off the the event for the guy to come out of his room? Okay, I assumed it was a timer, but. I didn't know if it would be something just absolutely silly, like I had to have this bucket and clean the bathroom. Dude. Besides, you didn't even clean up in there, you bastard. Holy shit! Murderer! There's a murderer here! Not a murderer, I didn't kill anybody! Oh, what the fuck? So you have to clean the bathroom. Or just don't give him his keys back, maybe. Did you see that dame with John? Typical. This has to happen to me. Did you see that hunk when Mrs. Steel? Well now, he is really gorgeous. <coughs> Hey there. Do you know where the keys are to that broken John? Don't bug me. I have a lot of work to do. <clears throat> yeah, I kind of need those keys. I left something there. Yeah, right. Maybe I'll lend them to you. But you got to promise to clean up that mess in there and bring them right back to me. I promise I'm nothing. For you. Clean up? Um, sure. You bet. Okay, there you go. But bring them back. Some of these dames ain't getting it. Maybe they want to try a real man. Baby. 
Okay, now I hear toilet sounds. I don't think I heard those last time. See how easy that was? You ain't so bad, you could open a cleaning firm. Yeah, and I'll use you as the rag. Is he gonna give the speech right up here? Mm, me too. When the winter comes, we'll ask him. Or is he gonna be on the middle floor? guy's gotta go check my work and then he'll probably come out yeah man I cleaned it get over it we are actually moving wasn't sure if it was just pretending like the boat was moving or not son was the terrible thing what all right hello there John I hope you're enjoying yourself good evening yes it's lovely here how are you <coughs> I hope you like it thanks we're glad to hey, be here I'm glad you could make it it's wonderful thank you <coughs> It's done. Let's see. So am I. Drink with me on this special occasion. It never occurred to me in my So is this uh is this gonna be the exit? This looks like a good spot to shoot him from though. I wonder if anybody would actually see me if I just popped him from right here. Find the weapon, men's room, kill the counselor during his speech. All right. Escape. Where the fuck was the escape? Right there? Get the fuck away from me, bitch! That seemed a little bit too easy. If I would have known that the boat was right there, I could have just ran right to it and been over. <laughs> First try. I mean, after I figured out how to fucking unlock the bathroom. And deal with fucking some guy knocking the gun out of my hand. Murder. Part massacre. <laughs> what? Tommy pulled it off. A massacre. Now all the politicians in the city are scared. Nobody wants to end up like the counselor. Nice job, Tom. But it's not enough. Now we're after Morello's right-hand man, his brother, Sergio Morello Jr. He controls the unions in the city. His biggest assets are the dockers' unions, <laughs> thanks to whom he practically controls every import into the city. We kill him, and a big part of Morello income <coughs> is gone. He's just thinking about hookers sitting there. I think I know how we'll do it, boss. Sergio is usually at the Italian Garden restaurant. There's a telephone in the restaurant, and across the street, a phone booth. I'm gonna plant some dynamite. You go to the booth and call inside the restaurant, saying you want to speak phone to Sergio. Phone bomb. I'll be standing in front of the restaurant with a Thompson. And as soon as Sergio gets to the phone, I'll waste him. Then we just gotta get to the car and make a quick getaway. What do you say? Sounds like you're yeah, gonna get shot. I suppose I can handle the calling part. 
Get to it, boys. <laughs> Vincenzo will give you your weapons. Yeah, I'll make the phone call. You do all the shooting. That's just asking for something to go wrong. Ooh, look at that. Always working on that fucking shotgun. Plus, why do you have a shotgun and a vice? Vincenzo, I need a Tommy gun and something for Tommy. Okay. Tommy gun with something for Tommy. Here it is, boys. I'll keep my fingers Thanks. crossed. Thanks. Wait, he gets a Tommy gun. I get a little fucking 1911. Sounds fair. <laughs> Tommy? I want... Uh, I've never seen this lock before. I want it. Hey, Ralphie. We need a car. Hey, I have a new, uh, t t t t t plan here. It's decent and a real big, s s sturdy car. You'll like it, Polly. It hasn't I've never seen this lock before. New I don't think I can lock, get in. But, but if a person is clever, it ain't no <laughs> problem to open it. Just like this. Nice and easy. Push in and click. I was really hoping that eventually he was going to be like, you open it just like this. And he punches out the window. Raise and the pop! It's open. Maybe Ralphie has something for me. Who the hell's Ralphie? What, what the fuck was that all about? Oh shit. I gotta read. the bridge. What? Oh, the red light. I don't know why I totally forgot about those. Just give me the ticket. It's fine. Street. <clears throat> 
Here we are. Stop right here, Tom. Mm -hmm. Never goes this good. Okay. I'll stay out front. Keep off from that boot. Say you want to talk to Sergio. As soon as I kill him, get me on way. Sure thing. So he's in that building. <clears throat> yeah, Mr. Morello, please. Hang on. Jeez, could he be more obvious? Mr. Morello is not here right now. Wrong guy. Buddy, Mercer Morello ain't here today. Try. Oh, 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 Jesus, oh, holy. Oh. It isn't him. You holy think he would have fucking knew Morello that? Morello isn't there. <sighs> that guy you hit wasn't Sergio. Sergio wasn't there today. Ah, hell. Now we're in shit. We're going back no to Salieri. No shit. I think he could have done a little bit better of a job than that. <clears throat> Jesus, look at that line of traffic. Get me the fuck out of here. What am I caught on their bumper? Can I shoot? Two fucking bullets, really? Do your job, you have a fucking Thompson. Should have lost him already. Perfect. Get the fuck out of my way. This car sucked. Trying to get me killed? Okay, I have to go to the bathroom.
You lucky bastard. Don't worry about it, Tommy. It happens <clears throat> to everybody sometimes. Vincenzo <laughs> and me have thought up a new plan. Biff told us that Sergio has a mistress sometimes. who he spends a lot of time with. He must be there today. <clears throat> Vincenzo has put together a little surprise for him. All we gotta do is put it on his car while he's inside enjoying himself. That's right. All you gotta do is put this bomb right under his car. Then you can just enjoy the show. It doesn't work like that. Sergio usually it's leaves never it that so easy. Hurry. This time it has got to work. His mistress lives in a house in Oakwood. We'll know he's there if his expensive little sports car is parked out in front. Stick the bomb under it. That sounds a lot better. I'll get going. <clears throat> All right, I'll take the bomb. Do I need a new car for this mission too? Good. No, I don't. <laughs> what will it be? I want to get rid of like all of these. to the other island again always going over to the other island okay well this time I'm gonna try not to get fucking pulled over these uh, speeding tickets are getting kind of annoying station. Do you ever even run out of gas in this fucking game? I swear, you're never in the same car long enough to actually go through a tank of gas. fucking fast. Oh shit. Right, left. I don't think I've seen this part of town yet. 
There it is. Let's have a look. I should probably get my car turned around. I have a feeling I need to get out of here fast. What's this clown doing? Fuck this. I'm fucking dead. dynamite under a car when they know I'm doing it. I have to be getting I have to be getting close to the end. Oh fuck me. Go man, go. All the way down to the end, take a right. Another right. There's no way my car's not faster than a fucking cop car, that's for sure. <clears throat> I mean this car is fucking fast. Next right. Dude, seriously? They're catching up? Are you crazy? <clears throat> All police have been informed. This is how it always fucking works. Destructible in this. All cops have been alerted. Awesome. Thank you. So happy. Oh, do they rubber band? Is that how they keep catching up to me? Fuck. So, I mean, it doesn't matter what I'm driving then. I just have to pull over and shoot them every time. Just get them off my tail. Huh. As far as they're not shooting at me yet. So I need to find a uh, private area to take out a few cops. Oh, fuck me, really? Christ, I'm not going to make it out of this. Oh, 
Okay, I better just do it right. <sighs> just don't get a speeding ticket. I wish I would have known that the cops rubber bind or rubber band. a literal boat with wheels. So if you're like way over the speed limit, is that when they pretty much instantly want to arrest you? Like, what is it, like 20 over, you can't go over? Okay, 70-ish, got it. So maybe I'll just try keeping it under 70. This 40 speed limit is intentionally too low. Where am I going? I gotta turn. Dude, what the hell? She was just floating and that car looked like it was gonna hit her. Oh, fuck. Alright, well, I'm not stopping for him. I don't remember. Am I actually supposed to go tinker with that dude's car in front of those other mobsters? That just seems like a really bad idea. There it is. Let's have a look. Why are we driving the same car? Bitch. Let's get over here and fucking find out. Are you kidding me? Not now. Already fucking failed it. game doesn't know what checkpoints are or is there a, is there a checkpoint button I'm just missing like F8 or F5 or something
There it is. Let's have a look. So if I just chill out in the car for a little bit, it'll be fine. Or do I have to actually get out and stand here? Wait for a cigarette to be done. Oh, there we go. Wait for that fucking cigarette. <clears throat> his chauffeur would have been best if that uh, dynamite was set on a timer so it was like 10 minutes after the car started yep Tommy and his fucking white knighting. He's got to save every like, woman no, he can. No, no, no! Hey, stop! Shit! Yeah, that was a bad idea. He should have just not been there. Damn, that's one hot dame. That girl. That's one came cringy out and fucking line. I don't know, man. Maybe he lent it to her or something. It just happens sometimes. There's nothing you could do. Put it simply, we gotta get this guy. Sergio meets with his bookie downtown in the parking lot of the Rainbow Garden Restaurant. Get Paulie down there to fill him full of holes. You'll just drive, Tom. They're doing a really bad job of trying to get this guy. Out. Now I'll catch that bastard. I promise. He'll be gone. And they won't even know how I did it. Now get a move on so you can still catch Sergio there. Like, I think I'm in the wrong mafia. Where the hell am I going? Oh, way down there again? Jesus. I mean, it kind of seems like our mafia has like four dudes in it. And theirs has like many, many, many expendable dudes in it. <clears throat> Plus, where's Sam been this whole time? I know he ends up like screwing you over or whatever, but where is he right now? Actually, I don't remember if it was Sam or Polly. I 
gotta check on something. get a guy with a sniper rifle to sit on top of a roof for a while and find this dude that they're looking for. Stop in that parking lot. Those men in black, that's them. Seriously, I'm supposed to stop in, in that parking lot? <clears throat> what was the last? Yeah, I know. Those are like the uh, little. Remember the old police call boxes you used to have? Yeah. I said to him, hey, pal. Tell me what. Dude, the... How do you fuck this up? You have a message from Mr. Salieri. What the hell's going on? Oh, no. Oh, no. Well, that certainly changes the situation, gentlemen. Kill that guy. He clown. just drops it. the red light <clears throat> Jesus Christ oh they see my gun and that's how you lose a tail Speeding again. Fuck. 
No! Handcuffs, really? Oh, cause fucking Polly had a gun. You stupid fuck. Dumb fucking idiot. <clears throat> don't want to redo that fucking part of the level again. <clears throat> I wonder if I could just gun him down. Hopefully Polly won't die in the process. God damn, crash already, fucking cop. I'm gonna have to gun this motherfucker down. <coughs> All cops have been alerted. Awesome. That's just what I needed. Fuck. This isn't gonna go well. Fuck, I need to get the hell out of here. <clears throat> Jesus Christ, now I have to outrun them again? Fuck you. Why couldn't his gun just work? Dude, he's gotta be a fucking idiot. Can I just get out of the fucking car and shoot him? Just trying something here. Get in the car, Polly. Get in the car. Oh god damn it. He's letting the letting the cop get a little close. Oh, the cop doesn't even know who we are. Put the gun in the car. You stupid fuck. Okay. <sighs> Fucking Polly. So always gotta get the cops involved. <clears throat> Empty hands. Okay, why is the wanted level not going down? Do I just need to steal a different car? I will ditch this car if that's what it takes. What the fuck? <clears throat> Don't hit me. I am stealing your car. Get in the car. I don't know why you have to be so retarded about getting in a fucking car. <clears throat> oh, so it's not Polly with his gun out the window that's like setting them off half the time. It's just me, like with it equipped.
I mean, it's good to know. I realized that I had my gun out, but I wasn't, like, aiming it. I thought if I didn't aim it, that it would be fine, but apparently not. Oh, all these things that I'm just now figuring out at the end of the game. Ah, fuck it, I'll run the red light. After so many foul-ups, Salieri gave the job to other people. I only went with them as kind of an insurance policy. Just sit here and watch, so you don't screw up again. You two are dead. You are very, very fucking dead. Amateur. Help. I mean, they're not wrong. <clears throat> we have sort of fucked this up a few too many times. Push him into the train. There isn't a train. Oh, there is a train. I mean, this seems uh, a bit excessive. They could have just had a guy with a Tommy gun out in that in that conductor station and just blew him away right there. We gotta get a train involved. <clears throat> 
Why don't the barriers close? Real damn professional. <laughs> no shit. <clears throat> wow. The cop just let me run that dude or run that chick over. Come on, car. I should have picked a faster car. I mean, I didn't even pick this car. Oh my god, it's so slow. <clears throat> don't I just, don't I have to just chase this guy until he crashes? Like, there's no real point in, like, trying to shoot at him or anything. Or am I thinking, like... I, I might be thinking of a Mafia 2 level. Are you fucking kidding me? Cannot fucking figure out why the internet keeps dropping out. It doesn't even make any fucking sense. <clears throat> 